This is a walkthrough video of 1726 Coconut. We're located just north of the Rosemary District, which is the area of tremendous growth here in Sarasota, which ends at about 10th Street, and we're at 17th Street. So the area goes down as soon as you cross 10th, but it is coming this way. And, and looking around at these houses in the neighborhood, they're not bad. I mean, they're not great, but, they, but they're not bad. And this house actually is kind of dirty and gross, but it's not bad. Um, it does need a roof, I can tell. The roof is original. Um, but it's a three-bedroom, two-bath with a one-car garage, and it's um, right on Coconut. This would make an excellent rental. I suspect you could rent this for $1,400 a month. Um, so the front door, I mean, it needs a lot of work. Let's, let's, it, the carpet, I've never seen carpet this dirty. This is like the dirtiest carpet I've ever seen. So the carpet's not salvageable. You really gotta do flooring. Um, but look at this high ceiling. We have, we have nine foot ceilings or even nine and a half foot ceilings in this main room here. Um, and you have this big open area, which is a dining area, I guess. And then the kitchen, and we, this is tile, and we have all sorts of different kinds of tile around and all sorts of different kinds of flooring, but it, it would be worth it just to do flooring. This cabinet is, is trash, but as a rental, you could fix that cabinet and keep the countertop and just pretty much, it's not terrible. As a rental, this would be a fine uh, kitchen. You need to put a fridge in here. The garage is nice, it's tall. Textured ceiling, no popcorn, uh, no automatic garage door opener. The panel is okay. It has plenty of room for expansion. Um, water heater's probably okay. It's actually wired correctly, and there's a hookup for the washer and dryer. And then over here, the AC is probably original. I'm skeptical as to if that... That might need some work or replacement. You can also see the base on which it sits has been a lot of moisture and that's kind of rot there. Um, but here's guest bedroom number one. Probably 10 by 11, little bedroom. The windows are decent though, newer windows. I think this thing must have been, I don't know when it was built, but it was probably in the, I want to say the 80s or 90s, probably 90. Um, bathroom. Just original vanity and looks like linoleum in here. Um, wouldn't hurt to do flooring everywhere. This is just a cheap laminate that was put down in this guest bedroom. Probably the same size, 11 or 12. And then the master. And the master is bigger, um, maybe 14 by 12. And it has a walk-in closet. You know, it's not a bad layout. It's got three bedrooms, and here's the master bath. has its own bathroom. All original stuff, but not terrible. Um, the roof doesn't appear to be leaking anywhere. I don't see any discoloration, but it definitely is old. This is an exterior door that's going to walk out to the, um, to the lanai area, which certainly needs screens. Um, you know... It's really not a bad house. Uh, not much of a backyard here. Just uh, gravel and we look onto someone else's backyard, so you're not looking at, at anything right here. Um, a walkway here. The fascia all looks good. I mean, you really need to do flooring and cleaning this things up and fixing some things and, you know, painting. And I think this would, this would make an excellent rental. If not, I think it would be a pretty good flip too because there's just minor stuff, nothing major. Um, I think if you fixed everything, like the cabinet in the kitchen and just spruced it up, maybe even do tile backsplash or just something, uh, granite countertops would be a bit overkill for this price range and area so I don't think I do that but I mean look at these windows they're they're good windows and um, block home I see no discoloration 
are gonna have to do a roof, probably. And um, well, almost for sure, it's time for a roof. Though it is not leaking anywhere, so, and it doesn't even smell too bad in here given the condition of the carpet. So I see flooring, I see a roof, I see miscellaneous painting and repairs and trim. Um, unknown on the AC, it's probably near the end of its life, but if it's working as a rental, it's fine. And so, um, a dishwasher and a refrigerator, but this is a, this is a decent deal. They're asking uh, 124 for it, and that's, it's, not, it's not bad. I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.